I went to a vegan supermarket yesterday in Liverpool. It's called Purple Carrot and it's on Smith Down Road. So I just thought I'd show you what I bought. So first thing is these fries at Traditional Burgers. They were £3.10. And I've never tried these ones before. I really like the fries brand. I really like the nuggets that they do and I really like the hot dogs that they do. So thought I'd try the burgers. Hot dogs, I got them a few weeks ago or last week and they're really tasty and I love these. They were probably about the same price as well. So fries, definitely a good brand for vegan food. Next is these Eat Real Lentil Chips. They were £1.80 for this like massive bag. It's like a 113 gram bag. They are in flavour creamy dill. Is that like sort of sour creamy kind of thing? But anyway, I love this brand and they started selling them in Tesco now and I keep buying them like all the time. Like the sour cream and onion and the cheese flavour and it's really good. Next three things, I got to make a trifle. So I saw these um, jelly crystals. So I'm going to have the jelly, the custard and the soy whip. Kind of like a whipped cream thing to go on top. The the cream topping was £1.85, the strawberry jelly thing was £1.10 and the custard was £1.35. I'm really excited to make a trifle because I've not had one in years. Next thing is this Suma Organic Italian Tomato and Basil Soup. I haven't actually had soup since becoming vegan or I've not had tinned soup since becoming vegan. I know I can make my own but I just got this for convenience really because most of the stuff has cream in it that you can get from supermarkets. So that was about £1.10, I believe. Next, I got this Zest Vegan Basil Pesto. The next thing was, well, I've already eaten one of these. I ate one last night for tea. These Tofu Fillets Wild Garlic. They were £2.80. And that was, it was really nice, actually. I just fried it in a frying pan and I ate it with some courgette on the side with a bit of pesto. The next thing I was really excited about, I saw this online and it is this vegan egg. These were expensive, these were £7.20, so I don't know if I'd actually buy them again. I thought you only got four in it, but you actually get about a dozen. So I'm really excited to try them and have it scrambled. So I'll definitely let you know how they are because I'm just so excited to have one. And I'm going to have some scrambled on toast for breakfast one day, maybe at the weekend. So we'll see. Next thing is this Vigo chocolate bar. This is a massive chocolate bar. I got like the huge size one. It was £3.25 for this one. And it was only £2.95 for the smaller one. So I just decided to get the bigger one. The next thing is this smoky Rosella mozzarella style cheese. This just, it's like, it comes in this like little tube thing. But I'm really excited to try this. I think I'm going to have this with a sandwich in a bit with a bit of tomato and some balsamic dressing. This was £3.80, so a bit pricey. But I don't know, I just wanted to try some new things. That was the main point of going to this supermarket to try a few new things. And I'm definitely going to go back and buy more because there's loads of like alternatives. Usually for general shopping, I can find a lot just in the normal supermarkets. But for like specific things definitely going to go to that supermarket next thing was this shiitake pate and i had one of the ones the vegetable pie from the vegan kind box this month so i thought i'd pick up the mushroom one this was 135 then i've just got a few bits from tesco so a bit of all pro vanilla yogurt some stir fry sauce some banana chips some courgette and some beetroot tagatelli which I've never had before, so I'm really excited to try that because I love beetroot and some soy milk. So that was just a little quick vegan food haul, just to try some new things really. Thank you for watching and I shall see you in the next video.